and welcome back to my channel my channel <laughs> my tiny little channel um, I just thought I'd pop in after a few weeks of nothing um, and show you some of the things that I've bought and um, the changes obviously the hair the barn it has been done I absolutely love it um, this is just one of the many styles it's had in the last couple of weeks um, I haven't washed it for a few days, got completely soaking wet yesterday and still managed to do something with it today. Also, new glasses, let me put them on. I will show you now. So that's my old ones. I still, still, I think these glasses suit me so much more now I've had the hair cut. And then, God, these are filthy. I don't know how I do it. I think I've just got dirty hands and... Just touch my glasses all the time. I haven't got dirty hands. They're clean. So these are my, love these too. These are my tortoiseshell ones. Sometimes I don't want to have a big, the big black frame around my eyes. So I've got the tortoiseshell ones, which again, I love. Um, and let me just show you my, just show you my shades. These are my lovely Liberty of London. Look at that shade. They're so chic. And when my hair's down and like styled, in that sort of like that sort of like 60s bob they look so cool with it and i love it so that's my chic little liberty glasses i went to the opticians with my sister to help her pick a pair out and ended up buying her two pairs of glasses as you do so let's get on with it um i have been following something for about a year now called dressing your truth by carol tuttle so just come back and I'll, I'll, I will try and put, I won't put a link in, I'll just put her name in. And in this Dressing Your Truth, it shows you how to dress, what colours suit you, what styles suit you because of the energy you give out rather than your, um, your um, sorry, seasonal palette. My seasonal palette is actually uh, Deep Winter, which is lovely, um, obviously deep, dark jewel colours, but also with bright whites and wintry um, colours. And my, so that, and my actual dressing your truth is called a, a one, which is tint. So that's any colour with a bit of white added to it. You look at what tints are. So for me, I will be in dressing your tooth. Just go and look at it. You're probably completely confused. I'm a type one and a secondary four, four which is um, light, bright colours. And my secondary is this dark, contrasting, not dark even, um, Pure colours, pure colours. So, let's go. This was, oh, do, 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 do. I'm going to say £2 from um, Dorothy House. And isn't it beautiful with the Chinese pheasants on it or oriental pheasants, I think they're called. So pretty, I love it. And those are the colours. I mean, this is from Shein. This is just one that I got the other day. But put that and that on and doesn't that go nicely together? Perfect. So these are my colours if I'm dressing with Dress Your Truths. They're the, the pale colours. Um, yeah, with a, tint, a hint of white, a splash of white. <laughs> Look it up. Go to Dress Your Truths. You can take a quiz about how your personality is, although it doesn't go on personality, and how and what your energy and what fashion, you know, if you like fashion and you're interested in colour palettes, seasonal colours, anything like that, have a little look. It's quite interesting. But it also helps... Um, it's helped me knowing who I am and I am that person and embracing who I am and helps me understand other people and their type, their energy type. So there we are. I got this for £3 from, again, Dorothy House. It's a lovely Bowden tote, lovely sort of like country, French country design on there. Although it's, it's also very, it reminds me of very Dutch design too. And I think that's the side in the middle. That was, again, that's, just three pound fifty, little little um pocket in there, and I have used this so much. It's just I've got another bag, but it's just too small, and this is just right. Um, I wanted a pale yellow. I've been looking for a pale yellow t-shirt for ages, can't find one, and I got just got this pale yellow lemony, slightly brighter than than it's showing. Um, from again Dorothy House, and it was two pounds. Fat face one, that one. Oh, sorry, that's size 12. Um, I got this from a different town and it's papaya, an oversized 
really pretty, just a button down blouse. Um, and you can button the sleeve, you can, you've got the button on there on the sleeve as well. Just really nice and very, very, very soft. It's not stiff or anything. I'll see how that looks. That's size 14 papaya, which I think. Mor no, Mor Morrison's. <laughs> which Morrison's did do clothes, but they do great ones. Matalan. I got this really pretty, gosh, vaudeville and burlesque. And that was, I believe that was three pounds. And that is, um, I don't know, I've never heard of vaudeville and burlesque before, but it's got a, just a nature, I suppose that would be. <laughs> like watercolour, a bit like Monet. There we go. And it's a 40s style, vaudeville and burlesque. I mean, yeah, that's it. 40 spot button down shirt, really pretty. I don't know what I'm gonna wear it with though. Mm. Try it with some jeans. I might have to, yeah, I'll see. But it was too pretty to let up. Um, what else I get? A pair of really pretty, really pretty. They're not pretty. Um, I'm moving, I can't particularly wear black, so I'm moving away from black. You saw when I'd have my hair dyed, that lovely, lovely light or nude, uh, it's called the brunette nude and it turned black and I didn't like it. So I'm trying to get away from that. So I've got these lovely, again, £2.25. Everything in Dorothy House is £2.25. And that's a chocolate brown coated um, jegging, jeans, sorry. And they are Frankie, which is a Dorothy Perkins and that's a size 14. Plenty of room in there. And then my favourite is this um, Peruna that was size 14 again. Everything's a size 12 or 14. Um, Peruna from that Deborah, which we got in town, and that was only six pounds. Look, it's beautifully lined. It's a gorgeous color, it's fitted. It's, I believe it's linen. It's got pockets, beautiful sleeves, and that is just so me, look at that. So it is a very bright coral. I don't know if you can see, hopefully you can see. The brightest colour you see on there will be the true colour. And it's just a little bit at the back. There we go. And it just is lovely. It's just lovely. This is a newie, and that's from Apricot. This is a coral again, but this is an orange coral. I can wear both very happily. This again, love that colour up against me. It's linen and it's beautifully made. I love apricot. There you go. It's, you can see it's slightly, uh, I don't know what you call that. <laughs> Sorry, I'm tired. Um, yeah, very, very nice. So that one. And then a couple of, oh, these boots. These boots I wanted, again, I, want, I didn't want black boots. I wanted a lovely, winter berry coloured boot and they are just gorgeous if that's not winter berry I don't know what is it's just lovely so these were again 10 pounds they are by Mark Fisher and I've looked it up online and they're quite an expensive brand but again they're not too high I can you know a block heel I can cope with I've actually bought some very 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 sexy pop socks because I can't get them on otherwise. They're very t they're very slim, but I need slim because I've got slim legs. I hate it when you buy a pair of boots and they're all flapping around, back, about around the top and you just, you, you scuff them together. Whereas these fit beautifully. I, I will do a bit of a try and I won't put everything on. You don't need to see me in a, a t-shirt. Um, so I've got that. And then I did a Shein haul. Um, I wasn't fond of anything that I bought. It all went back. So that was a couple of t-shirts, a really nice kimono, um, a sort of aztec -y, um autumn coloured um, butterfly sleeve top. Um, doesn't suit me. <laughs> so if you look on do um, this dress in your truth, you can, you know, the autumn, you know, I thought it was, I thought I was a type three, um, but I'm not, I'm a type one as um, I have been confirmed a type one as well, but I was like, no, I'm not. But yes, I am. But yes, I, cause like I say, if you're interested, it's Carol Tuttle, Carol Tuttle and Dressing Your Truth. But there are some things I did to keep and it's this one. 
I quite like this. I can work with this. Um, I, I like the, the pattern is very me. So moon, stars, um, suns, that's very type one. Um, and I really like this. This, this I can sort of, I think I can carry that off. I don't even need to try it on. Look, there it is. That's what it looks like on me. Perfect. <laughs> so that was from Shein. And like I say, I the kimono I got, I, I I could have done a try on, but I just wanted to send it back. So I think when I paid for it, I just wanted to get, you know, get the refund because I'd see, I had some other things in my basket that I knew that I wanted. This is also from Shein. It came yesterday. I love these sleeves because it equals me out, if you know what I mean. Rather than me doing that, it's got that little equal bit because I've got the big, the big woobies. Um, I've also got a bra haul coming, which I'm not going to, I could show you the bras, but I won't do a try on. <laughs> but yeah, it's difficult um, getting size and everything. So I've just gone back to Debenhams that I didn't know still did it online. So I'm really pleased with that. Anyway, that's my Shein shirt. I keep digressing. I haven't spoken for ages. And then this skirt. This to me is what I call a type one, four, which is what I am, type one, Jessie, you're true, <laughs> type four, secondary. So this is, you can see, that is a forest green, not a black, it's got a lovely sort of petrol, teal-ish blue, pale mint green, bright orange, a bright sort of like orangey red, and then you've got the lovely apricot. So I'm very pleased with that. Worn it a couple of times, very nice. These are large. Everything I've got is a size 12 or a 14. These are the large in Shein fits me beautifully and then that is a 12 to 14. There we are. <laughs> She's scratching the door to come out. So this, I really love this. Look at that. Got to do something about it. I don't care. Um, although I have got something coming from Vinted, which is non-tried on um, bodysuit, M&S. Um, Again, I won't try it on, but hopefully it'll help with a few little, little, I mean, you know, we need some help at a certain age. You know, taking this HRT and going into menopause has done a, taking its toll on my middle, unfortunately. I'm not doing, I'm trying, I do, ex, anytime I have a day off work, I exercise. I even do exercises on my days at work. I try and do a bit of yoga and um, I do a bit of weightlifting. You know, I'm trying really hard. I'm watching what I'm eating and, um, I'm just living with the fact that I may have to wear foundation garments, darling. Anyway, so back to jewellery. So I forgot to show you this and it's by Jules. Or did I show you? I can't remember. I've had to do this video again. <laughs> so this is a lovely bangle from Jules and that was from Vinted. That was £10. They've also got one that is just black. Uh, sorry, the, the navy and the white and with one pink thing on it, which I might get for when I'm wearing just navy or just white. But I love this. I wear every single colour that's on there. So that's great. It's just whatever I wear, this goes with it. Um, they do the, in, in different ones. They've got some with more um, autumnal mustards and khaki greens and possibly a different orange. But have a look on Vinted because they're beautiful. But don't buy the ones I want. And then, so back to Shein, there we go. These, this necklace, I love this. Really nice, the lovely bright, it's a lovely bright turquoise. It's not a muddy turquoise. So that, to me, is very much my colour palette, which is, like I say, a type one with a secondary four, dark chocolate brown and that very bright um, turquoise teal colour. Um, yeah, that was, uh, I think, about... 199 or 225 from Shein and I also got it in the orange. I haven't even opened that yet, but I love I love orange. Um, I got some again, these little things were when I thought I was a completely different colour palette, but I'll still wear them because earrings are earrings, aren't they? So that is a blue green with an orange. Um these I love these, so I'll be wearing lots of dangly earrings now I've got my short hair. These are a lovely sort of peacock, very boho, which I do love. Uh, that's really nice. And then you've got this little necklace. The, those, everything jewellery wise, wasn't even two pounds, I don't think. 
So if you're just trying things out, anything that I get um, that I don't like, I go. I, my granddaughter has it. She loves dressing up. It's never wasted. Or my mum has it. Oh, for goodness sake. Anyway, when this is untangled, it's very pretty uh, necklace. <laughs> It's a gold and black, it's a layered necklace and I will be here forever trying to untangle it and you'll be bored stiff, so I'll do that in a bit. But yeah, it's a, just a layered necklace and um, come on. That's probably it, that's it. It's very, very yellow gold, which is okay. Um, little black beads. A tiny bit of black's not gonna hurt me, you know? But I'm really, I'm moving away from buying black stuff because I put it on and it just doesn't move. It's just. Like I say, it's got no, nothing to it. Some people can wear black and I won't get rid of it, but I'll have to do something. I'll have to wear a lot of accessories. Um, so yeah, there it is. So can you see? Very pretty. I love that. Really nice to wore it worn it today. But I don't like wearing great big dangle earrings and a necklace. It's, you know, it's either stud earrings and the dangly necklace or... Um, yeah, or dangle earrings and no neck. They've got a um, Thornton's shop. Thornton's Carlton card. What's the card? Carlton cards? Can't say. Anyway, the card shop. You know, the one that has the Yankee candle. Anyway, there we are. I saw it's coming up October, August. Oh, that is just beautiful. That is a lovely smelling um, crisp campfire apples. I'm not a huge fan of too much cinnamon. It's got to be, it's got to have a sharp, apple smell to it. And this is the perfect thing. And look, 26 99 down to 13 99 So, yes, I'm having a bit of that. I do like a Yankee candle. And even at the full price, they last a long time. But 13 99 you know, you pay that in, in some shops for just their own brand that don't last very long. And then I got the tea lights too. Again, three forty nine instead of six ninety nine. Now that is a bargain. I should have got a couple of packs. There's how much? Twelve in there, I think. They're a little bit old over. They're, you know, you can see it's melted a little bit, probably in the wind in the thing. But I think there's twelve. Yeah, three, six. Yeah, there's twelve. Sorry, I can't count. There's four lots of three. It's 12, Sam. And what I get for myself. If I haven't bought chocolate, there's something wrong with me. You know this. So, yeah, these are on the market and they're still okay. And they will be gone by October. No, November, sorry. It's still okay until November. My favourite chocolate. And I'm going to really, really, really enjoy that. <laughs> and my husband will really, really enjoy these. So, they were six. Pounds? No, three pounds. Now I think you, sometimes they're down to eight, but they're usually a tenner for one of these in Sainsbury's, or eight pounds or something. So three pounds. I should have bought a couple. Oh, I should have bought a couple. And these are two pounds. So again, these are usually about three pounds fifty for for the twenty, like the proper ones. So snacks tonight. So, are you interested in seeing what this clothes looks like on? I can try it on for you if you like. Yeah. Okay then, back in a minute. So here is that lovely um, vaudeville and burlesque shirt. And I've just got it tucked in at the moment. It's a little bit tight across the, well it's not, it closes, but you know that gaping you get as soon as you open your arms. But yeah, I really like it. I think it looks quite nice just with, I just got a plain one. I'd probably wear a white one, but I love the shoulders. I love the look. Um, these jeans are a bit all right. This bit I could wear a belt, but I like it just like that. I've got a very small between my hips and my bust, I haven't got much room, so not much I can do about that. That's my actual body shape, <laughs> it always has been, yeah. But I really like that. I just got a pair of mules, and I don't know what I'd wear it with shoe wise, but I've just got these on for now. Um, but yeah, I really like that little look really cute casual with that really pretty thing but because i'm not sure i'd not sure i'd wear it with this these jeans are a next high waist boot cut with um they've got quite a nice double sort of like high waisted i don't want it too high waist 
but just this is just perfect just above the belly button so this is the um papaya it is so oversized i couldn't wear it like that in fact if i don't wear it out it's huge this is a size 14 <laughs> um see what i mean different 14s um so it's got the let's get that up find it so I, you can have it up or down but i quite i'll show you how how ruby it is which actually is quite nice i'm just not used to wearing anything so baggy i like my fitted but put it in there let's tuck it into the old the old front tuck that's quite nice i actually really like it so i definitely wear this i've just got my next um sliders on i think i showed you these can i show you these just little neck slides they're really comfy really pretty nice color same sort of color as this so yeah i quite like that nice open there i quite like that a bit posh for me isn't it um yeah very nice i definitely definitely would wear this definitely um yeah so it's sort of nothing's gonna hide that the only thing that will get rid of that is surgery because <laughs> i've been really really i've been a stone thinner than i am now it's still there um there we are so i am five foot three i weigh about 10 stone 10 something like that between 10 and a half and 10 and um between 10 and a half i don't know 10 stone something like that and um, i'm size 12 to 14 there we go so here's the little top from Peruna. I've just got it, I just walked back a bit. I've just got it with those little ankle boots and my boot cut jeans, little white, plain white tee. Oh gosh. So there it is open. I mean, the shape of it, you can see that um, it should really be done up, but I quite like the idea. So under, I've got my jewels bangle, my little beads, so that, that goes really nice together just like that or just maybe the top button done up even top two it does up all the way obviously i've got a little bit of a bit there that i'm not that happy about disguise it put, put, put some of these beads on maybe that looks really nice too those colors go really nice together um i quite like it just Having the top two done up actually. I quite like that, you know, that's really nice. Gets a little bit cool. Unroll your scarf. A little bit cool in the evenings, and you've got that nice. I mean, wear it however you want. I just put it on like this for now. And that goes really nice together. So, yes, love it. Really pleased with that bargain. Six pounds um, from Scope. No? Deborah, and they're normally very pricey, so I'd really pleased with that little little jacket. I've wear, I still get a lot of wear out of that. I need to wash. It smells like it smells like a charity shop, but uh, yeah, very pretty. And there, uh, here we are for a bit of neutral. So this, these are the brown um, jeans, coated jeans. This is just a little wooden and leather thing from Shein. Again, a couple of pounds. This is from Vinted and I bought it last or earlier this year. It's a made in Italy. It's got that thing down the back. I wore this out. We went to see a Shakespeare play, an outdoor Shakespeare play and I wore this with jeans. I think I wore these shoes and then this necklace, but I just have different jeans on. And just put this really nice Zara blazer on top. Um, I think I had a different necklace actually. And that looked really nice. Sorry, I got wet, so I got it wet. So I normally would roll the sleeves out again. My little sketches, ankle boots. These are the taxi cab boots. I'd like them in black as well, but maybe not. Just roll those up. And that looked really smart for sitting outside, watching the Shakespeare play. Um, yeah, £2.20. Five, £2.25. And these, are, I hate when they ribble, but yeah, you can see they're a brown one. Very Jim Morrison in these. I do feel like a bit of a rock star. <laughs> so here are the those lovely berry coloured boots. Got them with my skinnies on, and they are a perfect fit. God, they're going to hurt my big toe. <laughs> but those things. So this is why I thought I bought those like little ankle pop socks because they slide on easy. Otherwise, I've got to try trying to get them on was quite difficult. You can see they are skin tight. 
Um, this is the, I think it's in the same colours. So we've got the reds, which I really like. I think that goes nicely rather than just black. Um, and then just to pull it together, I've got the little bit of blue in the border necklace and the dark red tassel. I mean, you don't have to have it. There we go, that's plain, but I'm not plain Jane. And um, I love it. Let me just put my glass on, see what I'm doing. Pop these glasses on, fluff the hair up. And that is, I love it, yes. Could be the favorite, I like them all. Um, they say that skinnies aren't in. I'm sorry, I love a skinny, it's just the way it is. These again are from Next, these are a size 10, so who knows, but they are really nice, a really nice stretchy one. Um, this is obviously, this is from Apricot, I like the look, I like the silhouette there. I've got to say, yeah, I'm much bigger on top than I am down the bottom, but, and then, you know, it's like, well, how to dis I don't need to disguise it, people can see what I like. <laughs> so yeah, these, lovely, They're, they are very comfortable, it's just the fact that I've got arthritis in one of my toes. Um, I'll just put a bit of Volta, if I'm going to wear these, I'll put a bit of Volta on, I'll take some painkillers. <laughs> Hopefully that'll work. So, that was my little fashion show. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, I just realised I forgot to try the skirt on, but I can do that next time. Um, and there are some t-shirts, you know what a t-shirt looks like. So, I'm really pleased. It's, and like I say, it makes me look in the wardrobe and see what else I've got. Um, so, the, a couple of things coming soon. Like I said, I've got a Debenhams haul, but that's just bras. You probably won't want to see those, you know. <laughs> I won't be doing a try on, okay? <laughs> um, but I have got a little um, little Shein haul coming with um, a few accessories and a couple of jumpers. Um, like I say, I'm moving away from the dingy dark colours um, or the blacks. You know, the, all, I've got a lot of black jumpers. Um, gone like i said i've been every time i go downtown now um i take a bag of stuff to the charity shop if it's been on vintage for six months and hasn't sold charity shop easy and now i've made that because i'm like oh maybe fit me or maybe i'll wear it now i've actually made the decision i'm fine the funny thing was i went to the charity shop yesterday with granddaughter i went i saw something in the window went straight up i went oh that's nice and it was a top it was a jewel top that i'd given and then i went inside and i went straight to another top so obviously um hopefully well it wasn't in there today somebody's bought it somebody's got a nice bargain really nice jewel top but it had been washed and it had been tumble dried so it was really stiff there was no giving it um, I've got other jewel tops, so I, I hate that. Don't tumble dry your clothes or put them on a hot wash. <laughs> They're not supposed to be do that. Um, so I mess about my hair because I absolutely love it. I don't care. <laughs> it's a little, it's just a little, it needs a wash. It's just got a bit too much product in it now because I've been sort of putting it up, putting it by my ears, getting it wet again. Um, so that's it really. So as soon as that, um, the other vintage haul comes, I will do a little, little try on for you. I seem to have got quite a few pairs of, little earrings but they were like 65p um i doubled up on a pair that i didn't realize i don't know why i got two but they're sending two but again 65p i can give it to charity it's all to keep with my granddaughter she loves it and i get too much of the accessories so those are those um those blue boho ones i like that that looks really nice actually goes with this because these aren't bright buttons like i say i do like the bright colors but i do like to tone it down like i say i say with the dyt the do dressing your truth i'm definitely a one first so that's upward effervescent lights um positive but i also need my downtime and that's why i think i must be a four and it's the colors i like i love the type three colors but not on me absolutely not i look dreadful <laughs> This is typical type three. <laughs> the lightest, the, if it's got a, like a tint of white to it, like that little orangey brownie top I had on earlier, that, that's okay. I can just about do that. So I'm going to say goodbye because it's going to be another really long one. And I will hopefully see you in the next couple of weeks. I I try to, to um, do one a week and I can't promise anything. Um, really lovely to see more subscribers. You know, if you really want to and you've catch me subscribe, not forcing you. It's just something I enjoy doing and um, I'll see you very soon. Thank you.